Hey, good morning. I just want to share with you something today from my personal devotional that really spoke to me. Uh, it comes from the scripture of Matthew chapter 5, um, starting at verse 21. Let me read this to you. This is Jesus talking. He says, you've heard that our ancestors were told you must not murder. If you commit murder, you are subject to judgment. In verse 22, it goes on to say, but I, I say if you are even angry with someone, you are subject to judgment. If you call someone an idiot, you are in danger of being brought before the court, and if you curse someone, you're in danger of the fires of hell. And this is the NLT version, by the way, so it's a little bit more modern day translation. But verse 23 goes on and it says, so if you're presenting a sacrifice at the altar in the temple, and you suddenly remember that someone has something against you, leave your sacrifice there at the altar, go and be reconciled with that person, then come and offer your sacrifice to God. The reality that people traveled for days to bring an offering to God only to be told to go make it right with the people in their lives first is eye-opening. You see, back then, not everybody just lived right around the corner from the temple. Many people would travel for long distances to come and bring their sacrifices to God, to bring their offering to God. Imagine if you traveled for days. And then you were told, ah, ah, hold on, you got something that you got to resolve first. And you go and make that right and then come back. That's a big deal. And that must be a big deal to Jesus, the, all, the whole concept of resolving conflict. It matters more than we'd like to admit. So remember that today and as you walk through life. All right, I hope this encourages you. We'll talk soon.